Yeah, I've got Vader out and he's getting ready to head home and I had a little technical difficulties. I've already done this once, but um, in all honesty, I think he's doing really good. You know, the biggest issue you had was him jumping and especially jumping on people that he really doesn't need to be jumping on. And I, I can say with an older dog that it takes some retraining on your part. No, goodness, that was a little dramatic. Um, but it does take some retraining on your part, you know, to kind of make that successful as far as that goes. I wish it was going to be easy, but I do think you're going to have to spend a little bit of time really working with him, really correcting some of those behaviors. So um, overall, he knows what he's supposed to do. Sometimes he's challenging, but at the same time, he is respectful and he does take commands well. So I think that over time, he's going to get it no problem automatically. I think it's just going to take a little bit on your part. Ready? Okay, let's show off. Good boy. Like I said, that was a little dramatic, wasn't it, huh? Hmm? All right. No. Hey. Good. Okay. No. Quit. Stay. All the way out to the end of the leash. Turn and face. Pull, and he should pull back. This is the thing that is going to be key. He's got to relearn stay with you guys because stay gives you all the power. It teaches him that no means stop, that he can't get up until you tell him to, and he definitely can't be jumping on people if he can sit and stay like this. So the biggest thing is, is you're going to have to work some of these. You can see I'm out here talking. I'm just talking to the camera. But at the same time, I'd be going, good, Vader. Good job. Yeah, that's good. And making sure he just sits there and stays. All the way back to his side. You don't want him jumping on you. You need to release from the side. So get all the way back. Okay, he can get up. Get a reward. If he doesn't drop it. It's right there, buddy. It's right there, buddy. Boy, that was bad. All right, let's go. <laughs> nope. Uh -uh, back. Good, sit. Let's go. Good. Good job. Come on. Hurry. You're right back behind me. Where are you going? Good. Stay. You want to also do some movements with stay. So I really recommend getting out to the end of the leash and then doing some movement. Going about 90 degrees to both sides. While you're talking, making sure he understands that he's got to sit there and stay. No. Sit. Also, I didn't tell him he could lay down, so he's got to sit back up. Stay. When dogs start calling the shots and making their own rules, that's a key for trouble. So you want to make sure if you told him to sit and stay... He sits and stays. Now, he's fairly new at this. I wouldn't do longer than a minute, minute and a half sit, stay, but I do think he's more than capable. All the way back. Good boy. Okay. Good. All right, let's go. <laughs> he likes to be a little pushy, so left turns are not a bad thing. Get your knees up and get him in, get into him, make him get back. No. Good. Let's go. Uh, uh, back. Good. Come on. Good boy. Hey. Come on. You're a little weird today. Of course, like I said, we already did this one, so maybe it's just my luck. 
Good boy. Good boy. Huh? Are you watching? Ready? Get it. Vader, come. And he's got to sit. Notice that he's sitting out far enough that I can touch him, but he's not getting in close enough to jump on me. Get it. Vader, come. Hurry. Get it. Vader, come. Good. Get it. Vader, come. Get it. Vader, come. Get it. Come. Get it. Vader, come. Sit. No. Sit. Oh, we got to do one more because we didn't do that one right. If we don't do it right, we're going to pick up the leash and correct him for it. Get it. Vader, come. Sit. Good. Get it. Vader, come. Good. There's what I'm looking for. Make sure that sits automatic. We're not going to work down because we already gave me an automatic down while doing sit stays. I don't think that's a good thing to encourage. So we're going to work on place. Now, place is where you get on your bed and stay there until I release you. Bed's a little crooked. There we go. Place. Vader, place. Oops. I threw about three treats out there. Good boy. Did you find it? All right. There you go. You got to get all the way up there, though. You're cheating. Place. All right. Normally, we do pretty good with this. Vader, place. Good. Good boy. Good. So, you want him to, to know that he has his own spot. Okay? So, especially if there's a lot of activity going on and stuff like that, beds are where he's going to learn. This is his space, space spot to go, and he doesn't have to worry about getting in trouble. And then you don't have to worry about him jumping on people. Okay, get it. Vader, place. Hurry. Good. So, get him a bed. Make sure you work it. Work it all the way around so that he can't get off until he's released. Good boy. Okay. Place. Good. Oh, now you remember what we're doing. Okay. Okay, is his release. Good boy. Place. Sit. Down. Good job. Like I said, he's a good boy, and he knew quite a bit. I think that maybe the corrections need to come at a different time. Um, we're going to have to help you a little bit with that. And then you just, you're going to have to change a few rules. But I think overall, he's going to do just fine. So we'll put him up, give him a bath, get him all cleaned up, see how he does when you get here.